So we're uh, in vigor alone, and it's been a while since I recorded. But uh, let's check this out. So I got these little workstations that are crafting materials for me. You can see that one was full. So is this one. So it's been a couple days since I played. But uh, then I got this little station that makes food for me. But the only important thing about food is to donate it. Alright, if we come around back, I've upgraded enough to collect actual coins. So I get 11. But as you can see, we got a level 7 house now, and it's yellow. And I'm starting to see the flaws in this game. So you can get some nice rewards for doing the dailies, but like... Loot 100 glass. That might be possible. Craft 5 rifles. Uh, we'll check that out. Kill 10 outlanders with machine guns. It's assuming I see 10 people. So I don't have a plan for the M2, and I don't have enough parts. I don't have a plan for the SKS, and I don't have the parts. I don't have the plan for that, and I don't have the plan for that. And another thing I'm starting to notice is once you reach level 7, yeah, I need 325 chemicals, 974 metal, I need 116 glass, 139 chemicals. This stuff just starts getting really expensive. Like, electronics are rare, and they want you to find 172 of these. So to get crates, you basically need to do rewards or upgrade the airdrop, which costs real money. And you're not guaranteed to get said airdrop. Alright, here's another problem. I'm never going to use 30 shotgun shells in one go. But if I switch the stack over to one, I gotta like... Alright, I'm dealing with the sniper. Guy with a knife. Grease gun, shotgun, guy fully loaded, AK, Thompson, Thompson, shotgun, well that guy's fully loaded too. Now we got one guy that's going in with nothing, so he's looting and scooting. <clears throat> yep, one guy voted to upgrade the airdrop to green. All right, let's go. Be careful when looting, and always watch for danger. The farm's usually worth some weapon parts. This little shed should uh, have some good stuff in it. Here we go. 74 nails. All right, that was really close. Well, let's go for it. Uh, well, yeah. Need a better gun than a shotgun. Oh, this map is really good for weapon parts if you get over by these uh, barns and stuff. Right by one of the exit points. I've always gotten loaded up with stuff. Alright, what kind of loadouts am I looking at? G3s. A lot of people with nothing, huh? Oh, somebody's boosting the shit out of stuff. Awesome, guys. I have lots of point, but points, but I'll save it until... Holy shit. I'll save them up until I'm playing with warriors again. 
scout the area to get familiar with it. Don't forget that you might encounter dangerous outlanders anywhere. Yeah, houses are good for glass. That's fertilizer, though. Nothing in here. Yes, it is, lady. Yes, it is. I'm just gonna probably loot all of this and scoot because the exit's right over there. And there's a lot of stuff. See, if you're willing to spend money, the drops are so much better. Look at all this fertilizer. Alright, the exit's right through here. Where the fuck is the exit? Oh, it's over there. Yeah, I mean, that's a lot of stuff I just got. So, I think I'm going to leave. There's always more. Thank you. Yeah! Haha! <laughs> Look at that, 175 wire, 95 metal, 13 electronics, 211 fertilizer, 95 nails, 145 chemicals. Not bad. So okay, if you're willing to boost it up to four or 500%, that's not too bad. Man, too bad I didn't make it over to any of the weapon shit. I can actually... Now, upgrade some stuff. Uh, I don't really want to use metal. One hour and 30 minutes. Okay, that'll be my second upgrade. I can do this one for 10 minutes, though. Aw, oh, shit, I need the chemicals for my workbench. Ah. Oh, beta map. Yeah, this one's not very fun. Well, I'm curious, what if I purchase an upgrade? Is anybody else going to? Is that what it usually takes? Yes, it does. Take somebody to go first, I think. Okay, there's two points, oh, three points on this map I haven't discovered. Hmm. All right, uh, I wanna go to my undiscovered points, honestly. It's an achievement if you discover all the locations on every map. Can go to these cars right away. Should be weapon parts and vehicles. Nope, 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 nope. I don't want to leave. Okay. Ah, I paid good money for that boost. I want to at least get some gear before I bug out. Next point is some sort of river crossing. That's got to be this bridge right here. I guess we'll just hit up anything I find on the way. Ah, oh, this has already been looted. Not very well, apparently.
aware of the drop zone. It will be dangerous. All right, airdrops down. Somebody go and go for it. All right, I think it, we just get out of dodge. Kind of want these materials I have. Oh, I'll take a second Thompson too. Yeah, I know I'm going to get hit by this radiation probably on the way out. Yeah, radiation's not too bad in this game. Okay, we don't want to use metal on an upgrade, so... Wait, what? what's this? This is crafting time. Is this, this is the only thing I need glass for? Let's double check. One hour. Alright, why not? And then we don't need two Thompsons or all this really cool ammo. All right, and with that, I've been ZJ Deadman with Rockbreaker Studios. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. But uh, I just figured I'd talk about some of the things about Vigor. And as you can see, combat is actually few and far between. But, uh, yeah. Until next time, all I have to say is... Ah!